It's been a tough year for the Colorado band, the Magic Beans, what with the pandemic and now strangers making off with their merchandise trailer. Well, lucky for the Magic Beans, strangers can be kind as well. Here is Patrick Perez. The past year hasn't been magical for the Magic Beans. It was kind of the rug being swept out from under you and, and trying to grapple with like new ways to bring in revenue. All right, everybody, I want you to find yourself a dance partner out there. Unable to perform their music. Oh, the evening. Band members Scott Hashi and Cody Wales say they've been selling merchandise to help pay the bills. Because we have such a supportive fan base, them being like, we'll just buy it just because, too, because they love us. But this past Sunday, Thieves had different plans for the Magic Beans merch. It really took me a couple minutes to process and even realize that it was actually happening to us. Someone stole the trailer containing all of their items right off their van, their lifeline gone in seconds. This guy's out here in the freezing cold, and he lifts our trailer by hand and drops it onto his Suburban and drives away. Scott Scott says he thought he was being safe by putting a lock on the hatch, but clearly, as you saw in that video, that didn't stop them. Check this out. Property crime in the Whittier neighborhood has been increasing lately. According to the city's crime map, there were 121 auto thefts or thefts from motor vehicles last year. In 2016, there were only 64. That was our whole inventory, so we just need to figure out a way to re you know, recoup all that and get back to, you know, trying to make some money. And just like at the height of the pandemic, their fans are helping them out again. In just a day, their GoFundMe has raised more than $3,000, far exceeding their original goal. It's, it's totally crazy. It's totally crazy, super humbling. I, I can't believe, we can't believe it. Tomorrow's here. Scott says they'll overcome this and hopefully get back to performing music again. They already have an album in the works. It's called Slice of Life, and, and it's going to be a slice of life. A fitting title for the year we've all had. In Denver, I'm Patrick Perez, Denver 7. Oh, good attitude.